there everybody and welcome back to my channel my name is Renee and I like to share the postcards that I receive from postcrossing.com so I've been gone for a couple of weeks and I just wanted to share with you all of the cards that I have received not only do I share the official postcards but I also like to share the round robins and the direct swaps and I've got quite a few and again I apologize for being gone but it was the end of the academic semester I'm a university professor all the grading all the final grades, all of that as we prepare to go into summer. So I am now officially off for the summer. I'm off for three months, although I'm teaching summer school. Um, but for that three months, if you don't teach over the summer, you don't get paid. So when you always think about you know, professors that get that time off, well, we're not getting paid uh, for that. But I usually teach for a part of the summer because that gives me extra money to travel and I love to travel. Anyway, so let's get started with the cards that I have received that are official. So the first card that I received came in an envelope and I want to show you this card. So this one came from, oh my goodness, from um, Austria. Sorry, could not think about it. And look at that. So this is a card for traditional dress. This comes from Hope. And uh, she sent this card with that. I love that. And not only did she send that, but she also sent me an extra card um, for uh, my green because I love um, being sustainable. So while I'm thinking about it, uh, if you remember a couple weeks ago, I talked about a big award that I was up for the city. I won. I won. So I was recognized by the city of Little Rock. There was a huge event, me and my teaching partner, for teaching sustainable practices over the past eight years to a multitude of students at the university. So we were recognized by the mayor of the city that I live in, and we got a really big trophy each and everything. So it was absolutely lots of fun. So thank you for all of you who were wishing me good luck, but we won. <laughs> All right, the next card comes from China, and isn't that gorgeous? I love line drawings, and this card was a, um, a meetup card, and so there's lots of different uh, names that were there at that for uh, Lunar New Year, so thank you for that card. The next card, they did not sign the card. It comes from Taiwan, and it is a... Um, a walkway in Taiwan. Um, this is from the city of Tainan. Isn't that gorgeous? And let me show you stamps. So thank you so much for that card. They did not write their name. The next card comes from um, I'm not sure. I can't read it. Juanita, maybe? Anyway, this is from Lithuania. Sorry to pause there. Um, but look at that crown. Isn't that gorgeous? I just love it. So thank you. And of course, I was up the other day watching the uh, coronation of King Charles. The next card comes from Lithuania. This is from Austria. And she sends this wonderful card, I think I've got it upside down, of a mermaid with a large fish. Isn't it gorgeous? So thank you for that card. The next card comes from Val in the Ukraine. And it is a Feel Ukraine card. This is the second one that I have received of this card and I absolutely love it. Keep them coming and I support uh, the Ukraine. So thank you so much for that card. The next card comes from Nina, and this one came from Serbia. I had never received a card from Serbia before, and I love multi-view cards, and so look how awesome that card is. So thank you, Nina. I appreciate that a lot. Let me show you the stamp, just because the stamp is really gorgeous, too. And again, it was from Serbia, and I've never had a card from Serbia. 
The next card came from Germany, and this one comes from Stephanie. And look at that amazing dog. You all know how much I love dogs. Haven is over here wandering around. She thinks I'm talking to her, and so she is right here by my side. And then the last card is also from Germany. This comes from Jay. And isn't that awesome? I love the drawing there with the bicycle. So I really want to go to Amsterdam. Who knows? Maybe my summer teaching will pay for it. The next set of cards that I have for you are the round robin cards. So this one comes from Mike. I just received this today. Mike is also a university professor and he was telling me on the back that he is also done with his grading. And look at what the name of this book is. Essay and Essays in Idleness and Hilke. And I said to him, absolutely positively yes on the idleness. <laughs> now that we are both done for the summer. So thank you for that card, Mike. Joanne sends the next card, and it is a beautiful card of tea and macarons. I need to make macarons again. I haven't made them for a while. The next card comes from Joe, and this is from that new series that is all about um, weird uh, reviews left on like national parks. They're, it's called subpar parks. I've seen bigger mountains was one of the responses. And this was about Mount Rainier. Somebody had left a review of Mount Rainier saying, I've seen bigger mountains. So Joe, thank you for that card. I really want to buy that set of cards. The next card comes from Caitlin and I love this card. It, of course, is the queen who is no longer with us, but isn't she gorgeous in her bright pink? And even though I watched, you know, the coronation of Charles, he just doesn't have the grace and the decorum that she had. And so I miss her already. <laughs> so thank you for that card. The next card comes from Sarah Lynn, and it is a wonderful card from Spruce Grove. I love the, the uh, mill and the water tower there, so thank you for that card. The next card comes from Hoot Noodle, and she sends me a card from Palermo. She had been to this, to this area, and this is one of the cards that she had brought back. The next card comes from Mel, and she is a Pittsburgh fan, and these are the colors for the Pittsburgh Steelers. So thank you for that card. I'm a Chargers, now Los Angeles, but they will always be San Diego Chargers to me. So I'm a Chargers fan. The next card comes from Charlotte. And it is a wonderful um, illustration of the beach with starfish. I will be at the beach next week. <laughs> oh, I leave tomorrow morning. I can't wait. Uh, the next card comes from Savita. And this is a Did You Know About Sloths? That they may seem lazy, but they are pull-up champs. A newborn baby sloth can pull herself up with just one arm. Isn't that cool? So thank you for that card, Savita. The next card comes from Olga, and Olga sends me a wedding card from Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's wedding. Gorgeous, gorgeous. <laughs> the next card comes from Clarice, and it is another sloth card. Look at that baby sloth. Oh, I just love their faces so much. <laughs> the next card comes from Jennifer. And we're looking at White Bay. This is a vacation spot that she went to. So thank you for that card, Jennifer. Lori sends the next card. It's an Easter card. Look at that rabbit inside the bathtub with the eggs all around. Isn't that gorgeous? I love illustrated cards. The next card comes from Joanne. There are several Joannes that pay, uh, participate in our round robin. And this was a card for Earth Day. Love it. I celebrated Earth Day. I spent some money on plants for my garden. The next card comes from Lawrence. And look, it's another sloth card. <laughs> Aren't they adorable? I love some sloths. Barbara sends the next card, and it is a pair, well, three different bottlenose dolphin from Myrtle Beach. Thank you for that card. 
another Joanne, I told you there were several in our group, sends a Northern Lights card from Denali National Park. Now, I've been to Alaska, but I went on a cruise, and I have not been to Denali, but it is on my list. Lori sends the next card, and she sends me a Thousand Shen card. Look, it's the bottlenose dolphin. Hopefully, you can see the glitter there. And look on the back of the bottlenose dolphin. Look at the seahorse riding the dolphin. Isn't it adorable? Love it so much. <laughs> Then we receive another card from Hoot Noodle, who sent me another castle. This one is Iverness Castle. I have not been to Iverness Castle. My favorite castle is Bodium Castle. So, and it is in South East England. So, Mary Ellen sends me the next card, and this is Ticonderoga. This is a, a paddle wheel boat. So, and I've been on a paddle wheel, paddle wheel boat once um, on the Mississippi River, and it was just a lot of fun. Uh, Lindy sends the next card. This is a handmade card. I love handmade cards. And this is some of that, she calls it sun paper. So she put down the leaves and the flowers and put it outside, and the sun colored the paper blue, and what was underneath stayed white. Isn't that cool? So thank you for that card, Lindy. And then the next card comes from Leslie, and we see some beautiful whales. I love some whales, and you know that. Anything marine. <laughs> so those are the cards that I received from the Round Robins. Now the last cards that I have are from the swaps, and they are direct swaps. So let me start parsing these out here. The first one comes from Linda, and Linda sends me this amazing street art card. Now notice that it's an octopus, but it is done over a grate, um, a street grate. Isn't that awesome? Thank you so much, Linda. I love that card. The next card comes from Smokey, and Smokey has his own channel, and it is linked down below, and he said as soon as he saw this card that he knew he needed to send it to me. And so what we have here is a whole bunch of different interesting marine critters. Um, these would all be classified as zooplankton, by the way. Zooplankton are the small critters that eat the plant um, floaters that are called phytoplankton, like algae and stuff like that. And then these are the ones that are eaten by fish. So thank you so much for that card. The next card that I have comes from Rob. Now, Rob also has um, his own channel. It's linked down below. And when I saw this card on Rob's channel, I told him it looks like those beluga whales are glowing. Look at that. And even in real life, it looks like they are glowing. So thank you for that card, Rob. I absolutely love it. The next two cards come from Lewis. Now, Lewis you need to have your own channel at some point. But Lewis lives in Dubai and he is always so generous. And look at this beautiful flower postcard that he sent. And he said that he was worried about me and he hopes that my family and everybody was okay. I told you that a, a tornado went through our town here not too long ago. I was perfectly safe. Nothing, um, the tornado touched down about five miles as the crow flies north of my house, which is about seven, seven, yeah, about seven kilometers away. So we were perfectly fine, perfectly fine. And he was not done there. He also sent me another plant card. Isn't that wonderful? Agave, aloe agave. I, on my Panama cruise over Christmas with my son, I actually went to an aloe processing plant and learned how they process it for things like lotion and stuff like that. It was very cool to watch. Then the last few cards that I have, there are four of them all come from Jilly. She has been so busy this season. And Jilly also has her own channel, Jilly Be Living Her Life Her Way, and it is linked down below. Please do get, go visit all of these people. They have amazing channels, so much better than mine. So the first card that she send me is, sends me is one of the new Robin Hood um, postcards and I love this. Also notice 
it's King Charles on the stamp snail. And this is a maxi card. And one of the fun things that we always do, we are part of the unicorn gang, me and Jilly and Rob. And so she put a unicorn on there. The next card, she says this card reminds, reminded her of the movie Up. And that's my favorite movie. And so it reminds me of Up too. But I absolutely love this illustration. And just so you can see, we have another unicorn right there in the middle. <laughs> The next card is another maxi card. This is another new series. Notice it's a Prince Charles stamp up there. But this is a Dahlia, a beautiful, beautiful flower. One of my students this semester was named Dahlia. So this is perfect. And again, let's not forget the unicorn down there. And then the final card that she sent me was this card right here. It is a one of the lenticular cards that is three-dimensional. And she says, do I think it's a trout or a salmon? I think just because, and she said she loves fishing. I love fishing too. Julie, we should talk. Like I grew up fishing every weekend with my grandfather in uh, West Palm Beach, Florida, Jensen Beach, Florida, around in that area. Um, I think to me, it looks like it is a trout, and he's using a fly to fish with, and so I think it's a trout. The spots, the, how deep the spots go on the body, I feel like it's a trout, and trout are delicious. And so there is that, and again, let me just share. There is the unicorn, and I think I forgot. Let me go back. The card from Rob, because again, it's the three of us that are the unicorn gang. There's Rob's unicorn. <laughs> so thank you everybody for these postcards. So until I see you again next time, please stay safe and healthy and have a happy post-crossing day. Bye for now.